All right, Scorpio. Um, thank you guys for those that are still sticking around. Um, I know I've been a little MIA, but I'm back. Um, and really whipping, I know I say this almost every month, but I'm getting better almost every month. I just had to step away for a little bit. Um, but I hope everything's been going well with you. And without further ado, we're just gonna get straight to the reading and see what's going on for you um, during April, 2019. Also, I'm doing things a little bit different. So instead of doing like the past, present, and future like I was doing, um, I really stopped and thought about how much that really didn't make sense because the past already happened. And then I'll be doing the next month's reading. So we should just focus on the month um, so we can get the most out of each reading. So um, see what's going on here for you in April. Um, could feel like somebody's getting away with something um, or being sneaky. So just be careful in regards to like, just be mindful of the type of people that you're around really. Um, or maybe you even, this is a general reading, so maybe you could feel like you're getting away with something. Um, but I do see um, like an offer of love in April. So that's exciting. Um, and I see that um, you're offering a love and I feel like it's because you're deciding to like keep your cups or like continue to work on something instead of going on to the unknown. Um, could be with a fire sign, um, Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius, but somebody who... I just feel like you may be feeling, I don't know, I feel like you're getting the, getting back into the swing of things, but you may not know how to be like creative or fun with it or um, like there's some type of delay or, or blockage from you moving, either moving forward or um, like starting something new. But I do see something new happening. So I wonder, I don't know if you're going to have many offers, but we'll continue with the reading and see what it shows. Um, April, there just may be also a delay in getting like a new job position as well. Let's see what kind of person you um, will be, either who you're interested in or who your partner is. Get some clarification Ooh, on that. Okay, you could, one second here. You could be dealing with a Libra or somebody who is kind of imbalanced right now or may not be just or may not be like fair in this situation or like really could just be very imbalanced right now. Get some clarification. Somebody who may be like caring a bit about what other people are thinking instead of looking inwardly to make a decision on things. Um, could also be getting an offer of love from a, let's see, it's so bright, from a uh, earth sign. So that could be Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Um, but there's somebody that offers like not only love to you, but stability. And support for you. Somebody who's like, you know, somehow able to provide you with um, things that you need, like such as shelter, clothes, um, like any support or help that you need to like get that steady um, foundation again. 
Um, I do see could be dealing with um, a Sagittarius um, or like it's almost as if something I don't maybe some bad karma <laughs> may come up so um, just I mean, if you've been doing everything right, that's nothing really to fear. That could just be a delay, too, and some um, good fortune coming your way. So maybe, like, you'll have the offer of love, but it, you might not see the fruits of that um, until another month. Um, but that offer will be there. Um, I see you not being able to, like, move on. So I don't know if there's something... I might do a more clarification on who either you're interested in or your partner is because I feel like somehow you're holding back from moving on to something that you've already invested in emotionally. Something that you already planned out so you don't want to take that step to go into the unknown because you already feel like left out in the cold. You already feel some type of way. So it's almost as if you want to stay within your comfort zone. Somewhere where you feel like you already have that security. So I don't know. Yeah, we're going to, so I'm going to do one clarification and then I'm going to do, um, use another deck to specify like whether it's like an interest or a partner to get just some more insight, just in the case you might have both or just in the case it may just be different because this is a general reading. Um, see why we have the justice in reverse here. Because like, so the person you may be dealing with or interested in may not be able to look at things in a different way. Could be stubborn in the way that they think or unshakable in the way that they view things um, in regards to the relationship or if you're not in a relationship yet just in regards to somehow how what they may know about you or what other people think about you. Like they don't want to shake those views. Um, we have you'll receive news from afar I wonder if that's in regards to the offer of love and stability here some clarification um, also could be dealing with a Pisces so very likely a Libra or Pisces um, I just named the other major cards or whatever stood out but um, I feel like it could I feel like it's more than likely a Libra or a Pisces but again this is a general reading um, you have everything on here so far um, I know like as far as what's on the table there's no air though but we'll see here Get some clarification on um, in regards to somebody you're interested in ooh that's a lot so It just feels like whoever you may be dealing with or interested, if it's somebody you're interested in and not a partner, um, they just may be busy. Um, they could be busy, you know, helping others right now. Um, and just don't know the words to say sometimes, um, how to communicate. And they're just coming out of those sleepless nights. I don't know if they're... They may have told some lies. And that's crazy because we saw this card earlier, but it was upright at the beginning. It was upright at the beginning, but it's not one of the cards I pulled out. But I feel like it was. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know why I feel like it was, but this is like somebody trying to get away with something, but they get caught. So this is somebody that you're interested in. Um, let's see if this if you have a partner. Some clarification. Uh, 
Wow, justice in reverse again. Very, very well could be dealing with a Libra. So I'm interested in what this offer of love is. And maybe this is something that comes by and you don't really, you're not even maybe, maybe you don't even see this. Maybe you don't even see this coming at all in April and it just happens because I feel like you're focused more on the past or what you already have worked on before. Whatever cups you've already accumulated, that's where your focus is. Where I feel like this might be something out of the blue and something new because I don't feel like here anyone's really providing that stability. If anybody was, it could possibly be the person that you're interested in. Um, but even they are just, I don't know why I feel like, if you're interested in something, I feel like they're going through their own mess and they don't have time to focus on you back. Um, if you have a partner I feel like I just feel like this might not be the best situation in regards to like being having that balance being on the same page kind of thing because it's like I see the justice in reverse twice And it's not like when they're making decisions, they're not, it's almost like they're not making decisions based on how they purely feel deep down inside about you. It's more about, um, cause it's like they're having a stubborn, unshakable view on you, but I don't feel like it's a fair view on you. Um, and who knows like, what could have happened in the past for them to have that stubborn view on you too. So again, this is a general reading, but because you could have, if it's somebody you're interested in that you had cups with in the past, that you could have been like got away with something as well. And they're trying to get, they're already now getting out of those sleepless nights and getting over those lies and they don't know how to communicate. Like, and they tried to help. Again, this is a general reading. Um, but if it's a partner, I just feel like they just have their view. That's just what it is. I don't feel like it's with their heart. I feel like it's mostly with their mind and a stubborn point of view is what I'm getting. But you will receive a message, um, receive news from afar. And I feel like just, you know, being open to whatever message you or whatever opportunity you have here that could bring stability is something um, to look forward to. Um, but just be careful too because you want to make sure... Just because I see justice in reverse twice, I just, just making sure that things are fair. Fair for you and also fair for the other person. So it's not a one-sided thing. So don't just think about, hey, what's fair for me? Even though you do, I feel like we should always put ourselves first, but then also thinking, okay, what's fair for the other person? Is this going to work for both of us? Um, yeah, that's what I have here for your guys' reading for April 2019. Um, be sure to like and subscribe and I will catch you guys next month. Thank you for watching.